Afternoon YouTube, it's your boy Leon Mtubukulu, welcome to my channel. Like and subscribe if you haven't. Basically subscribe, you don't have to like the video. But if you want to see more from me or hear more from me, you can subscribe, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to talk about patenting. I know, I know, I'm late into the game. It's a 2014 movie and I'm talking about it in 2018. But I had to check it out because I was hearing people talk about the second one. And I had to see the first one. I couldn't just jump into the next one anyway it was an endearing story like what else can i say i mean like it was a fish out of water story a lot about marmalade it was cute man i mean like british people do love their bears from ready to poo to Paddington. it's probably some uh, some other bear but it's a great story it's like you know greatest showman it's one of those stories i don't want mind my kids even you know, watching. It's all about accepting your weirdness. <laughs> One of the best moments it had was the Mission Impossible moment with the whole vacuum. I, that moment was everything to me. I liked the acting. The actors were amazing. Had a lot of tutorials, like actor choices into it. And also, Nicole Kidman was savage in it. You know, her logic behind being a killer was weird like it was understandable but it wasn't relatable you know what I'm saying because her father doing the right thing made her into a bad guy which is not the most endearing quality about a person but it's understandable in the class her family once was it's like the whole Krypton situation they got ripped out of the station, the standard, which made her want to reclaim that, which was understandable. I mean, I give Paddington an 8 out of 10. It was a good movie. The VFX were proper, you know. He could blend in with normal people. I, I don't know if they did motion capture or not, but I was convinced, you know what I'm saying? That's my thoughts about Paddington. 8 out of 10.